I imagine you've played some cold weather games in Northern Iowa. Yeah, well, so we got lucky. For home games, we played in a dome. Like we oh, played okay. in a dome, but okay. but there was definitely some um, away games we had. So I th we played South Dakota State. I know they were outside. That was always a cold one. Um, Missouri State, I know we played. They, they, they were a little cold up there. Um, but all the all the team like North Dakota State they play in the dome, South Dakota play in the dome. But um, so not a lot of cold games. I know high school, I played in a game that was below. Or it was like negative two, I think, out my high school, my junior year, and got beat 59 to nothing. So that was uh, not a fun experience that day. But yeah, so. Yep. What's the uh, for for an offensive lineman? Is it does it matter playing cold weather games? I mean, I guess I it's mean, not comfortable, but... It's, yeah, it's not, I mean, not what you really want, I guess. I mean, it's it sucks, but it's a lot of mental toughness into it. I mean, um, yeah, it, it takes mental toughness to not get cold, and, um, you know, you got to you gotta play no matter the circumstances, whatever whatever it is, you got to go out there and play. I guess he was saying because the ball can get slick and also feel like a rock, mm -hmm. but you guys don't really handle it. Yeah, that's ball. not really for us. I mean, I guess... I mean, I guess like grabbing people and you know punching people. I guess that can your hands are going to be you know, stiff, stiffened up. So that could definitely. But we're, we got to go out there and just uh, you know we can't let that like we can't be distracted with that. And we got to you know fight that adversity. But you got the gloves and the hand warmers in the front of the jersey. Uh, <laughs> I, I won't. No. <laughs> You're not going to use that. No, no. Hands? Not very hands. Glo no. Gloves, but no, no. yeah. So how much more comfortable are you now coming back from the injury with your role on the team? Um, yeah, well, week by week, I'm feeling a lot more comfortable at, uh, you know, kind of my role I've, I've been doing at Jumbo Tight End. So, um, yeah, every week it just gets, I get more comfortable and um, things start to kind of click more. So, yeah. Going off of that, um, you just you seem to be happy and in good spirits. How are you physically and mentally right now? Good, yeah. Uh, physically, I feel great. I mean, it's it almost feels like my foot. It, feels like nothing really happened. I mean, physically maybe a little behind because I haven't been, I wasn't doing a lot of football related stuff really. It was more working on rehab, but um, yeah, it feels great. I mean, back, being back out there mentally, I feel great. Um, just excited to, you know, keep playing football. Was it, was it tough just the, the preseason pre action you had and then following that up, just jumping right into the regular season? Um, was that a tough transition, and what's, what's the difference in that in those reps? Um, it was it was different, I'd say. I mean, in preseason, we were getting a ton of reps and like practicing every day. We were getting tons of reps every day. The preseason games getting a ton of reps, and then kind of in season, you kind of have to dial it back. So it was uh, it was different. It was different. It was a lot less reps, and it's kind of when you're coming off an injury like that, and you haven't been doing all that football related stuff it's kind of hard to get kind of the rust off I'd say but um, you know it's you got to do what you can do I mean you can't control the amount of reps you get so you got to get them off by yourself so um, I've been really working that and um, you know just getting back into it and getting back to the hang of it almost. How tough is it to lose Caesar? A guy who's made tremendous strides this season started in every single game and yeah. the importance of this line. Yeah it's, it's definitely hard to uh, lose a guy like Caesar down. Um, you know, he was having a great year. Um, having a guy who's been around, he's been around, what, like four years now? It's uh, its hard to lose a guy like that and a guy with experience and who's having a good year, so. Uh, this might be a dumb question just because I don't really know how this works, but uh, is playing like the jumbo spot different than playing like left yeah. Um, yeah, it's a lot. It's a lot. I mean, I've never done anything like that before, really. I mean, college, we we had a couple jumbo sets that I'd come in and uh, come in and play, but I was already playing left tackle. But uh, it's a lot more stuff. You gotta kind of know. You gotta know some motions, some shifts, stuff like that. So uh, it, it was definitely a lot of thinking early on, but um, you know, re like repeating it every week, it's kind of it's kind of slowing down. I'm kind of understanding it more. So. Um, yeah, I'm getting I'm getting more comfortable at it.